if he's proven innocent, they, mm-hmm. the, the, as we saw with James Gunn, Disney can swallow their pride and actually bring this person back. And also considering that this would be really bad press for them if, if they yeah. kept him fired. You know, mm-hmm. it's better to keep him in there. So I, I imagine they're kind of waiting, but I, I, I'm i just bracing myself for the worst. I think this brother's out. Yeah. Maybe maybe you just settle out of, settle out of court there. <laughs> You know what let's man let's go ahead and get into this let me go ahead and just prep a little something here my might be some very bad news it just broke people and i'm getting Terrible. it from different sources so i'm just that's why i'm not saying anything because i saw one right. source that popped up and right. i did not trust that source not the person that sent it the actual people that reported it did not gotcha. actually believe yeah, no, that yeah, make sure but I'm looking at other articles right now to make sure that what I'm seeing is actually true. And looks like looks like some of this is not very good news, man. Let me go ahead and bring up. Oh, I hate to do this. I hate to get into this. I feel very bad. It, yeah, I, I was well, dreading well, I, this for a long time. Yeah, I thought if everybody stayed quiet, it'll just go away. Like, <laughs> yeah. as, all, as, all, as all things do, right? It never works that way. You know what? Nah. Not at all. Not as long as the internet exists. They will yeah, never, I, the internet will home, never shut up. Yeah, I thought whole girl recanted everything and it was all good. Some of you are hearing about this right now. Jonathan Majors, who is set to be the next big villain in the Marvel Universe, the next phase of the Marvel Cinematic Universe. So, what's it gonna be? Batman. You like you ain't got no job no more. <laughs> Unemployment. That's what it's going to be. You ain't got to worry about it. No more. <laughs> He's like, hey, I, thought, I thought you were fired, man. But <laughs> damn it, man. Yeah, I'm looking at some of the stuff that's popping up about Jonathan Majors in Ant Man, and who was again set to be pretty much the next Thanos. But it looks like things are not going in a good direction right now. Jonathan Majors. And manager entertainment 360 part ways actor facing domestic violence allegations in New York City. Now, this just popped up, y'all. This just popped up. Well, this came out around six o'clock. So this is about three hours before we're doing this here. But I didn't see it until right now. So, you know, today. When things are popping up and it's like this, you see a news like this, that means it's been about three hours since I read this. That means that I'm pretty sure other bad news is about to follow. You know, if he's yeah, yeah if he's splitting ways with his his management, that means that and, and and that's because of domestic charges. They know something that a lot of other people probably don't know yet. And that right. probably means that this job is going to be stripped of him right now. Jonathan Majors, incredibly talented guy who is on, on the rise, they call it a meteoric oh, yeah. rise right now because it, it was happening so fast. But uh, he was just in Creed three again, mm-hmm. going to be the, 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 you know, the, the big bad in several Marvel movies. Uh, a lot of people loving this guy. A lot of people saying he was on his way to win an Academy Award. If he was, you know, if he was on a trajectory that he is on uh, mm-hmm. all of that. Start to seem like it was it was crumbling down after the charges of domestic abuse from a girlfriend. Now the girl said that she dropped the charges, said that he was defending himself, but and he re, he was going out pretty much saying he's innocent. I think he was even wearing clothes saying uh, you know uh, uh, freedom or something like that. Right. But uh, you know with these kind of things, people are saying until you know for sure until those charges are actually dropped, until you know mm-hmm. we get something definite, no one knows anything. That's the kind of way I was looking at it. And sure enough, you know, people saying that we can't really go by this testimony of this girl yet. Domestic abuse charges in, in situations are very complicated. Uh, mm-hmm. So, yeah, man. So anyway, you want to read this article real quick? Or you want me to yeah, read this article we, to you? We need, we need to. <clears throat> oh, so this is from a source that I do trust, which is Deadline. Talent manager Entertainment 360 has dropped Jonathan Majors. Several sources tell us. The recent move by Major's longtime manager comes three weeks after the magazine Dreams star was arrested on domestic violence charges in New York City. Currently starring in Creed 3 and Ant-Man and the Wasp, Quantumania, Major's 
departure was due to issues surrounding the actor's personal behavior, we are informed. Major's representation problems don't stop with Entertainment 360 PR firm, the what's that, the Lead Company? The Leddy Company? Mm-hmm. Also initiated a break with the Avengers actor in the last month. Man, that means he ain't got this Marvel job no more. I'll tell you that right now. That's what it that's what it sounded like, man. Everybody's breaking off, you know. Everybody else gonna break off too. This ain't sounding good at all. Damn, man! I, 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 can't I have nothing today? Now I'm gonna make this about me. Can't I have nothing? <laughs> Why are they always doing this to me? Why is all this, all this happening to me? I, you know, can't every time I love something, it just leaves me. <laughs> got marital problems. I just had got through having a uh, an argument with my wife. I mean, with, well, not my well, we have my wife, but my mom, uh, my mom, I had an argument with her. Just got through. I ain't talked to my mom in weeks. So between the wife being gone, my mom ain't talking to me, and now Jonathan Majors is leaving me? God damn! Hey, man, it might be you. <laughs> it must be. <laughs> oh, no. I you know it hurts like it does for a lot of people, man, because, you know, this guy is a great talent, man. He's an amazing actor. Amazing actor. And it was yeah. so great to see this actor starting to take these roles that, you know, and I, and I know everybody's not going to like that I bring race into this, but it means, look, in my line, it means something to you and me. This brother was taking mm-hmm. very dignified roles, man. You know, now, you know, mm-hmm. me, me, that's an honor to have this kind of gravity brought to, you know, uh, a, a role like the, like King. Oh, yeah. I mean, that, yeah. I mean, he was a villain, but man, it was such a dignity to the way he played it. You know, and yeah, he played I mean, he it was, well. Yeah, he was setting it up to be uh, very diverse and whatever. Kane, he was going to be next. You know what I mean? Everything was going to be very different from how he was going to play. You know, he wasn't, he, he's an actor's actor when it was coming to these things. And it's sad because you wanted to see this type of brother win. You will have a problem with the studio and your management company, at least, I, you know, I don't know the business that well. I, I would imagine that your management company would be the ones to actually kind of stick with you at first. Of course. Yeah, they, <laughs> your management company, they come with the vacuum, they come with the ammonia, they come with the, yeah. the rag, <laughs> the boom, everything. They come, they dust that whole shit down. They, they clean the crime scene. But when they show with all the equipment, like, you can't do nothing with this. That's a problem. Yeah. That's a problem. Yeah, if you're, yeah, if you're like, that's right, man. If your management company is not sticking by you and they're the ones not trying to clean your image up, they're the ones not fighting for you. If they're like, can't be the f- are you anymore, man. You know, that means that they are scared of you. Like, you are, you know, you're, you're a problem. And they do not want that image on them either. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. They don't want to get no. dirty. No, not at all, man. Especially now where, you know, we're so uh, close to the beginning of something. You know, this is the time I guess you want to try to salvage. And, you know, the elephant in the room, elephant in the room i'm sure you're gonna get to it everybody's gonna compare this to who your man ezra miller oh they're gonna they're gonna, yeah. com- they're gonna compare this to ezra miller and i and only thing i can say about ezra miller is that you know was he he was convicted of what breaking somebody's house that's the only thing he was convicted of breaking somebody's house and taking alcohol was he convicted of or even brought for charges for uh, kidnapping somebody or something like that? Did that, anything go yeah. up against him, or were these things just alleged or people are are, are reporting these things? I, I, you know I, see, what I mean? The thing I still don't know what was going on with Ezra Miller, man. We talked about yeah. this. We talked about. Yeah, this we did the last time we talked and, about and, it. Yeah, and again, I'm not trying to defend Ezra Miller at all. You know, at all. We saw that his crazy shit at all, and we see how you know this other company was is trying to you know try to help him <clears throat> clean up his image already. The only thing I would say is that the studios, they put a lot of money into this idiot. And that was a business call to keep this shit going. Now, if they keep him after this movie, I think we have a, a, a cause to, you know, to, 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 I think we still have a cause to be up in arms. Yeah. So, but, you know, if, but if that happens, you know, that, you know, more up in arms. I, I think what, okay, so not to make this about Ezra Miller, but I think it's a good comparison right. that you're making here. You have because, to, you have to, because everybody's going to bring that up. Yeah. I, I, I really do believe, I really do believe that. Ezra Miller, I believe that, first of all, we're dealing with two different studios. Correct. You know, so that is, you know, one one is uh, Warner Brothers and the other is Disney. Uh, mm-hmm. So I, I truly believe that they put so much money into this Flash trailer. Oh, it's not trailer, but this Flash movie. Movie, yeah. This Flash movie that uh, that they don't they they don't have any choice but to. Let me see here. They don't have any choice but to try to keep him around. 
Yeah. But I think what's going to happen is, is that after uh, the Flash movie comes out, damn it, my internet don't want to work again. I got to do something about this. Be trying to bring up these clips and this shit don't want to do right. Um, I think that after uh, the Flash comes out, I think we're not going to be seeing too much of Ezra Miller around. They already had this movie finished right here. This was oh, yeah. this was done. There was a lot weighing on this. Uh, mm -hmm. So they, you know, with them having this finished, I think at this point they said it's just it's easier just to keep keep the, keep this boy around and you know try to spin this in a way that he's not right in the head. We're trying to get him some help. He's working. Mm -hmm. He's he's making progress, and we'll just <laughs> do that until this movie comes out. And once this movie comes out, which everybody's looking forward to. I don't think you're going to be seeing a whole lot of Ezra Miller, but that's just me. You might. Who can tell? Now, with yeah. Jonathan Majors, the difference is, well, for one, is Disney. Disney's probably, they they have an image where they really don't want somebody right. with those uh, those kind of, that, that reputation of allegations were around with them. The other yeah. thing is that he shot this movie and then it happened. I don't think there's another movie where he sh that he shot where he's Kang, where right. you know it has so much writing on it. So it's easy yep. right now, if they have to, yep. to make a clean break with him. And also, mm -hmm. let's not forget, and we said this last time, that this man is playing Kang the Conqueror where he has a lot of variants. And they could just yep. say, you know, they can get another black dude and just say it's another yeah. bear. Hell, they can get a Mexican up in there if they want to. You know? <laughs> Out of Kang, you true. know, they can bring anybody up in there if they want to, man. Hey everybody, here I go interrupting my own video again. I'm sorry about that, but we have to stop and give a word out to our sponsor. And that is Sunday, not the day, but the lawn care service. Yeah, that's right. The weather's getting nice again. We're all enjoying it, but that means you got to go out and do that yard work. I know not everybody's looking forward to doing that, but you are looking forward to having a nice lawn. You know, you don't want to be the ugliest lawn in the neighborhood. In fact, you want to be the best looking lawn in the neighborhood. And that is where Sunday lawn service comes in. Very easy to get a nice looking lawn. All you got to do is go to GetSunday.com slash Toasted and enter your address and you'll get a customized plan just for your own lawn. That means you don't have to make any trips to the store. You don't have to carry any big bags for the fertilizer and all that kind of stuff. In fact, all you need is a water hose and use that to apply the fertilizer from Sunday to your lawn. And you can do that sometimes quicker than it takes to watch a TV show. And Sunday only uses the best ingredients. Hey, Look at this dog right here. I know she's cute, but she's also very tiny, which means that she runs very close to the ground. Now, if I had a bunch of chemicals back there in my lawn, then she'd be rubbing all up in that, getting sick. And if you have kids, you really don't want them out there in some harsh chemicals playing around. And that's where Sunday comes in and makes you feel good about that. Sunday uses no harsh chemicals. There's no long waiting periods when you apply the fertilizer, which means that the kids and the animals, they can get right back out there and you also can get back out there and enjoy your lawn. And here's the best thing about, well, there's a lot of good things. I want to say it's the best thing, but it's a really, really great thing about Sunday. It's economical. You know, I have a lawn. I've checked out lawn services out there to come out there and take care of it and make it look real nice. Sometimes over a thousand dollars. That's right. We're looking at a thousand, fifteen hundred. I've seen it. I've been charged that before. But with Sunday, you can get a full season service for a hundred and nine dollars. That's right. A hundred and nine dollars. Almost ten times less than sometimes what you pay to get a nice lawn service out there. I'm gonna even save you more money. Look at this. I just told you to go to GetSunday.com slash Toasted to get that custom plan for your lawn, but you can also get 20% off that custom plan if you go to GetSunday.com slash Toasted. You're already saving a thousand plus dollars on this service, and you're going to save more when you use that link right there. I want to thank Sunday for sponsoring this portion of the show, and I want to thank all of you out there, as usual, for your support. All right, I know you're getting tired of hearing me talk. Well, you're going to go hear me talk some more, but about what we were talking about when we started this. So back to what we were saying before. Thank you very much. I believe because there were there were reports and I said, I, I don't know if to trust these these little rumblings going on of recasting. But I guess they were kind of true because there were a few sites out there who were saying yes. that. Listen, y'all, well, you don't have to believe us, but little birdies out there. Been, little birdies been talking to that mouse and they said that uh, mm -hmm. they. they they might be already considering. They said, just in case, 
just in case. Mm -hmm. Let's 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 have our spare ready to go. And they've already been talking about that. And the, you know the guy that they're talking about right now, right? No, that I don't know. So this should be interesting. The dude that they're talking about right now is another guy who's on the rise. Unless he messes up. And uh, that, mm -hmm. man, you know what? If this dude messes up, I'm going to even be like, just get a white guy now. We ain't have, we're, <laughs> we're not, we're not having luck with this. <laughs> third, third strike out, player. Third okay. strike. It's, it's just starting to make us look bad now. So you go ahead and just get a white one. We'll figure something out. <laughs> yeah. we'll, we'll come back afterwards. Keep going. Come back to, come back to us. Okay. Yeah. Oh, hey, black folks, let's get together. Let's, let's work yeah, together. <laughs> Huddle up, y'all. Huddle up. Huddle up. Huddle up. Yeah. <laughs> but, oh, oh, let me see. Oh, Who's let me the new see. rising star? They, oh, they, you, you know, they, they can mix and match them all the time. Who, oh, who next? Oh, here, let me see. Oh, you know what? I'll find it for you. I'll find it. Uh, oh, here, I have it. Let me see here. Shit, our Asian brothers are on the rise. Shoot, get, get some of them <laughs> popping off. You never know. Man, you just had one talking about rape. We don't... <laughs> we can't. <laughs> We gonna talk about that too. We can't. Do, we, we can't do that, man. <laughs> we gotta talk about that. Yeah, we gotta too. get up. This, this is the next person that they uh, that they're considering, and I'm being serious. This is the next person that they're considering to be king in uh, in the in the Mar in the next phase of Marvel movies. Hey, where the bitches at? <laughs> <laughs> can you see him coming out? Of, can you see him coming out, 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 of a, out of a time portal? Uh, <laughs> oh yeah. Hey, where the bitches at? It's supposed to be titties. Where okay, so I'm halfway joking. Uh, so it, it, it it's, it's not that dude that's going to be. Oh, it's not. No, man. I wish. Oh, man. I wish. I wish it was. <laughs> Man, oh, I would love. Man, I would love that dude. Like, <laughs> like, can't you see him arriving at the Avengers compound? Hey, where the bitches at? <laughs> <laughs> oh, first day of the job. It's boy. the first day on the job, man. So it's not him. It's actually this guy, Damon Idris. Oh, okay. Yeah. They, so there's been rumored that this guy's on the come up, and that he's probably going to be. Uh, is that his, I'm sorry, Damson. Damson Idris. So they said he's probably going to be the next that 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 the, the, the guy that they're considering heavily to be king. He's a British actor. He's in that show Snowfall. Oh, okay. He was just in Swarm. Yeah. He's going to be in a movie with Brad Pitt, a Formula One movie where he's uh he's a young Formula One racer. So oh okay. So that that there's just uh, rumors of that right now. Of course, I'm sure he's on the short list. Yes. Yes, he's another one that's on the rise, man. Another guy that's a really great actor. So, uh, you got he can get on that major's workout list, workout regimen, or something. Oh yeah, yeah, yeah. He's going. Yeah, he's got a lot of rice and chicken to eat right now. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, you oh, see, smiling, man. Now. <laughs> yeah, well, now listen, man. Uh, you know, innocent until proven guilty, right? Kind of hope that this is not what it is, you know. But it's not looking good, bro. His his. Two agencies have left this man. <laughs> this, 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 this is done. <laughs> this, this is done. But I, I'm just saying this so that I can get used to it. <laughs> Damn, man, I left the window open. You came in and shut that shit. Yeah, I saw your finger. <laughs> <laughs> Cold out there, damn it. <laughs> damn. Somebody said get a... Get this man to do it. Kang, man. <laughs> get, <laughs> get Terrence Howard. I'm back, man. I'm back, man. I hope he does come back for uh, Secret Wars or something. That'd be hilarious. Well, yeah, I'm joking, man. And it's and, and keep in mind, people, we're not joking about the actual uh, domestic abuse that happened here, alleged domestic abuse. That's a right. that's a sad and serious thing, right there. You know, we're mostly talking about the business aspect of this, and that's why we're having a good laugh with it. But it's yeah. very now, it's tragic. It's very tragic. Now. Would this turn around if he came out talking about he goes to anger management treatment? Does this change anything or no? At this point, yeah, being dropped? I don't know, man. Now, <sighs> James Gunn was mm -hmm. dropped by Disney and brought back. But we got to keep in mind, it was just for tasteless jokes online. Right. You know, that, and that's how much Disney does not want to have that kind of image affecting them. That's what really separates them from Warner Brothers. That's why I think, you know, 
Uh, it was they, they were so quick to sever ties. So I don't know, man. If uh, if something comes out, I'll just say hypothetically, you know, mm-hmm. if something comes out where he is proven completely innocent of this, regardless of who mm-hmm. dropped him. You know, if he comes right. out and he's proven innocent on this, because they haven't, yeah. Marvel has not made an announcement yet. You know, so no, not been, at all. Nothing's been said. So I even think Marvel is kind of like, we are going to hold out to the last goddamn minute. We put so much yeah. money in this dude. So I can see that. Yeah. So I think that, I think that if, uh, if he's proven innocent, they, mm-hmm. the, the, as we saw with James Gunn, Disney can swallow their pride and actually bring this person back. And also considering that this would be really bad press for them. If, if they yeah. kept him fired, you know, mm-hmm. it's better to keep him in there. So I'm, I imagine they're kind of waiting, but I, I, I'm i just bracing myself for the worst. I think this brother's out. Yeah. Maybe maybe you just settle out of, settle out of court there. <laughs> and let's keep in mind, again, not to make anything racial out of it, but, you know, there's, there's a heavy bias on, you know, still black actors Ooh. out there. Of course, of course. That's all. That's always in the room, man. It's always in the room, in the corner, in the ceiling. It's always somewhere up in there. You know that. Yeah, especially with violence, man. Uh-huh. As I said, you know, yes. black black men being associated with violence that already kind of conjures up fear with a lot of people out there. And Disney don't want to. Sure. Disney don't want to scare the white kids or anybody. Else, you know? uh, yeah, no, you're right. Yeah, terrible. This is no. It's awful, man. It's tragic. I mean, it's tragic for a guy whose career was. I mean, the world was being open to this guy. They were, you know, they were <laughs> opening the gate to this dude. But also, yeah. if there is a victim involved, that's terrible for this person, man. It's sad that yeah. this had to happen over something that, if if the allegations are true, that's really shitty mm-hmm. that it had to happen over that. That you know, you're hitting your girlfriend and all that kind of stuff, man. You yeah. know, I don't know. Yeah. It doesn't help that she was she was a white white woman too, right? Oh, was she? Ooh, I think shit. so. Okay. See, that's so. a ah, oh, that's another thing, man. That's another thing that really uh, is sad because now, because oh, you know these these uh, these racist websites love to take these stories and just use oh, it yeah. as a blanket statement against one group of people, man. Of course, man. This is hey, listen, man. This is their fire right here. This is their heat. Yeah, and I, I mean, this is what they're gonna use to blanket, like you said, blanket everybody, and they're gonna hold to it. I I told you, man, that uh, I was telling. I think I was telling Martin this that <laughs> so. These racist websites, they just make shit up. They just make numbers up and put it out there. They say they say some shit like <laughs> uh, nine out of ten white women that marry a black dude end up dead, not injured, up, you know, <laughs> murdered. <laughs> some numbers that is has, has no uh, basis on any kind of study no. or, or, or any kind of uh, uh, proof. You know, they just no. make it up, man. <laughs> yeah, this is whatever falls out their ass. See, look. Nine out of ten turds say that. <laughs> <laughs> so they're gonna look at this guy. And they're gonna say, "See, even a, ref- a a so-called refined gentleman as Jonathan Majors, a, a so-called talent. Look at him. Even he can't control his beastly black nature. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? <laughs> damn, <laughs> double B on him." <laughs> Beastly black, God damn. Beastly black. <laughs> damn it, man! Somebody says some Billy and Julian are serial killers. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this is this oh. is this is sad, man. It, it really is. I'm I, like I said. I know that you know. I, I'm 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 really heartbroken behind this, man. I was I was so I was such a fan. I was such a fan of this man. Uh, you know, no, and, and like I said, man, you know, I hate that there's any kind of crime where there's a, an alleged victim involved. So, you know. Yeah. No, uh, I mean, like I said, man, hopefully I don't know, everybody gets the help they need after all this, man. I don't know. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. It's tough out here in these streets, baby. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. Tough out here. Oh, he, somebody says like he died. Well, shit, career yeah. probably going to be dead. So, yeah. Yeah. yeah, I mean it's it's uh, yeah. He might as well be if, if if everything goes down the way it's going down. I'm not gonna see him again. <laughs> so it's like, yeah, yeah. So I'm trying to think, man. Was it like, now? I'm sure. Like none of us wanted to, none of us wanted to actually think about this. But I'm sure it was in the back of a lot of people's minds when it was being reported about these allegations here. 
is there anybody that you had in mind the whole time that you wanted to play King in case they got rid of Jonathan Majors? No, I didn't. I wasn't thinking about anybody because I, I thought that pick was just great. I, I saw nobody else in that role. I was like, all right, cool, John May. That's that's perfect. Just like when Chadwick Boseman was Chad was uh, <clears throat> cast as Black Panther. I said, perfect. Damn, somebody, somebody took my answer and put it up in the chat. Uh oh, yeah, no, they 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 hit it though. I'm glad we, that we think alike. All right. Uh, so I was thinking that this man. I think he has what it takes to be in a superhero movie, man. And he was already in one, and I really enjoyed him in that. But I'm looking at this here, and I was saying, you know what? It would have been great if they could have got Aldous Hodge. Ah, uh, okay. Yeah, I think I, Aldous Hodge, man, is is a guy that I thought would be perfect as Kane. That okay. would have been my choice. I would have chose. That's, right. that's that's who I would have chose. Yeah, well, he definitely has the acting chops, man. So yeah, I wouldn't, I wouldn't be angry at that either. Yeah, he was just Hawkman, and uh, yes, in, in yes, Black he Adam. was, in, uh, and Black Ass yeah, Adam, Black Ass, <laughs> which, which was a Black Ass failure, uh, you know. Yeah, so big time. So yeah, I no, thought, I, I'm not angry at that. Yeah, no, I thought you know what? Well, relative failure, depending on how you look at it. But I thought give this man another chance in a superhero movie and let him be yeah. the one. I thought he had he had exactly what it took to be. Uh, or what it takes to be the next king, but I'd like him to be a uh, Green Lantern. He might be a good Green Lantern. Oh, that's true. That would actually be great if he uh, yeah. could be Green Lantern, man. Yeah, John Stewart, he'd be awesome. Yeah. What do you think about uh, this 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 guy, Damson Hard? I mean, Damson Idris. Yeah, no, he has a similar, almost a similar look to uh, uh, Aldris, right? Hodges, Aldris Hodges. He does. Yeah, he's a similar, similar, similar look. <clears throat> so yeah, yeah I can see that. I can see that too. Yeah, I'm, I mean, I'm happy either way, man. I'm just happy that these. Some people are saying he's too young. That's kind of what I was thinking, man. But you know what? I'm gonna. Not, I'm not gonna judge until I see what he does. But that's why I was thinking about Aldous Hodge because I thought Aldous Hodge mm. was a little more mature. I saw him being on the same kind of age level as probably a bit Jonathan older, Majors. Jonathan Majors. But yeah, yeah, this guy, he's one of my favorites out there right now too. So, well, we'll see. Again. Yeah. Nothing, nothing has been said yet except that this man is nope. even that is uh, said to be still kind of alleged right now. So let us just say yeah. this. This stuff is coming out constantly. You know, when you start getting oh, news yeah. like this, it's like this. Once we're done with this show, it's going to be something else. So oh, yeah. Yeah. who knows how much of this is still <clears throat> how much is this still true and how much yeah. of this is, is is not and how much of this is actually going to happen. You know, we don't know. Deadline though, they pretty good with this shit. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> God damn. Now we're shutting the window on fingers, man. <laughs> Get, getting colder here, Corey. Yeah. Yeah. You sh before you shut the window, you push the ladder down. No, ah, ah, ah. Yeah. Yeah, man. Shit, between them and TMZ, man, it's like, ooh. Yeah, if TMZ yeah. reports on him, that means he's dead. <laughs> <laughs> Straight up. Yeah. I'm gonna put now. I'm this. I'm gonna be messy. I'm gonna be messy here, man. <laughs> messy. I'm, gonna be, I'm gonna be okay. All right. Yeah, I, I'm gonna be. I'm gonna. I'm gonna. I'm gonna start some shit, man. I'm gonna say something that's that's that I'm. It's not. It's not true. I'm just saying something. But let me see uh -oh. here. The controversial part. Let's do it. That's the, man. This is known to be a controversial show. Let's yes. let's live up to that, man. So let me let me type this in right here. Oh, will you stop doing that? Uh, let me see here. All right. Let me put this up here. <laughs> Somebody said Medea's Kang. Who said that? <laughs> Ghost tap? <laughs> <laughs> I'd like Medea's Kang. I like... Kang! That's what you call me, Kang! Time ain't nothing around here. Time, time ain't shit! <laughs> you know, we saw these videos of Jonathan Major working out. What's up, Men's Health? It's Jonathan Majors here. This is the gym. This is how I train. So, do you think you think he might have been taking something that made him get angry and hulk out on this, on people? Ah, <laughs> uh, you know what, man? It's funny to say because that that did cross my mind. I didn't want to say anything. That roid rage? I don't yeah, know. Yeah, I, exactly. I was, exactly. I, I want to, yeah. you know, I, I'm just hoping that my man just ate mad chicken. 
I don't know. Did he eat him because he was I, mad? <laughs> I'm, <gonna> take, <laughs> I'm sorry. That's my New York vernacular. <laughs> <laughs> Hopefully he made he ate a lot of chicken. <laughs> <laughs> sorry. <laughs> I was hoping they did that, but I don't know, man. Uh, you know, to get that big, you need some sort of uh, you need some sort of help. You know, does it have to be? Doesn't does it have to be steroids? Does it not have to be their own type PED, whatever type of nonsense you want to yeah. take. You know, it could be you know shakes and all that stuff. But that did cross my mind. But you know, I don't know. You'd have to be taking that for a while to really, you know, start bugging out like that. But then again, who knows when he really started training? I don't know, man. Don't put me in this. That's the thing, <laughs> man. Like I said, I, I'm, I'm being messy. I'm starting some shit right now. So I'm, just, <laughs> you know, I'm saying, I, I'm just saying that you know, did he did he roar it out and just you know just start smacking people and shit? I mean, I don't know. I don't you know. know, I'm just I'm just putting it out there, but it, I, it's. It's not true. I'm just asking questions. That's all. I'm seeing what people man, think. No, no. Yeah. Yeah. Oh, well. Yeah. Terrible day, man. Terrible day for, for people who are fans of Jonathan Majors, man. And, and like I said, not to not to uh, come in and overlook the victim in this. Who, you know, the alleged victim, if, uh, if everything was true. You know, that's really terrible yeah. for, that, for that person, too, man. Uh. Damn. Damn. Can't have shit. <laughs> you know what? These days, I'm just not gonna. I'm not gonna like anything. Oz, you ain't. You know, you're not my friend, man. That's it. Might as well, man. No, get, get, no, no you're no. not my friend. You know, get, get, I'm doing this for you, man. My friend. <laughs> my friends have a tendency to, to get hurt or die around me. So, <laughs> oh no! <laughs> yeah. It is time to go then. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a curse now, man. I, I can't have nothing. Can't have nothing in my life. It's a mess, man. Uh, yeah, it's funny because that was the one shining thing that Marvel ha- has going for right now. Not saying he's going to go anywhere or not, but, you know, as it is right now, you know, he's like the one shining thing. Like, if everything else goes wrong, like, you know, Jonathan Majors is good as Kang. Let's see what he does, you know? Yeah. You got to you got look, you got got look to look forward to his performance, you know what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. But, you know, see what happens, man. Uh, somebody else put a... I want to see. I don't know. What do you think about this? Uh, we got... A fellow Coleman out there. Oh, what do you think about? Yeah, uh, what you, about? What'd you what, what would you what would you think about? Oh, your boy Coleman Domingo as Kang. Coleman a Domingo. That's Kang. Man. You know, I, you know, you know who I wouldn't mind him being. Who? I wouldn't mind him being Professor X. <laughs> <laughs> Wouldn't mind that. I can shave, see his it. <laughs> shave his head off. Shave his head off. Cut his head off. <laughs> I mean, shave his head off. <laughs> Cut his head off and just be a body in a, in a wheelchair. <laughs> that's not a bad. That's not a bad idea, though, man. Hey, that's not a bad that. idea. Mm. I like that. That's a good choice, though, man. I like. I like hey, it. But uh, but yeah, got, got, I like your choice of him as as uh, Professor X. Hey, yeah, Professor X. Yeah. He has, we see, he has a, we see him in that uh, show, um, Euphoria. He has a great compassion when he's talking to people. You know, you can feel his compassion. So that's, that'd be good for Professor X. Yeah, I talked to him, man. Uh, yes. Interviewed him. Yeah. And he, great guy. And he, he talked about his character in uh, Euphoria, man. So, you know, I mm-hmm. can definitely, this guy's got, you know, he has a lot of faces, man. Thank you. Yeah. Kind of like Charlie Murphy right there. So. Oh, man. Yeah. Ah. Uh, yeah. I, I tell you, it will. It's sad, but I'm kind of excited. If this this happens, and I really feel bad saying this because if I had it in a perfect world, you know, everything would be just as they were. You know, he'd still be King Jonathan Majors. But I'm kind of yeah. excited to see what's going to happen, man. You know, a shakeup is always kind of cool to, to kind of see, you know. Always excited yeah, to see. I guess, man. Again, man, I, I'm not as invested in Marvel as I used to be. So whatever they do is all right. Yeah. You know. Uh, who's Mustafa Shakir? Mustafa Shakir. I'm going to look that up. Mustafa Shakir. Shakir. He would be perfect. I can see that. He's mad. He's pretty tall, too. Man. He's mad tall. <laughs> <laughs> I try to clean it up for you. <laughs> No, I know what you were saying earlier. I was just saying because we talked about steroids. Oh, yeah. was, like, was he actually literally mad? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, this gotta be oh, good, bro. man. Yeah, this gotta be. Yeah, good. nah. I co-signed that. Where's the pen? I'm signing. Where's call that man? 
Oh, that man. Get him out there. All right, y'all. Well, again, very tragic, man. Sucks yeah. that this had to happen. Ah, see how this all plays out, man. I ain't writing them off just yet. You held, you holding out there for hope, huh? Well, you know, I'll see, you know, it is simple proof before proven guilty. Let's let's try that, huh? I hear you. No, I, I'm not. Like I said, I let's made sure it. to say that it, anything could change. Yeah, anything let's could change. Nothing's it. definite right now. Nothing is definite. <clears throat> oh well, sad, sad to even hear that it got this far. But it does yeah. not look good right now. Right now, yeah. it does not look good when when deadline comes in and starts talking about this. As somebody said, deadline is usually dead on. So, damn. There you go, y'all. We'll see what happens. Stay tuned.